differential evolution is a population-based optimization algorithm designed to search for optimal solutions in real valued spaces. It was introduced by Storn and Price in the mid-1990s and emerged around the same period as particle swarm optimization. The method is particularly effective for solving complex optimization problems where the goal is to find the maximum or minimum of a function. The algorithm works with a population of candidate solutions where each individual represents a possible answer to the problem. The population is usually initialized randomly, although prior knowledge about the search space can also be used to guide the initial setup. Differential evolution operates through three main mechanisms, mutation, recombination, and selection. Its most distinctive feature is the mutation process, which relies on the differences between individuals in the population. Instead of using random changes, new candidate solutions are generated by using the vector differences between selected individuals. This allows the algorithm to adaptively explore the search space based on population diversity. To perform mutation effectively, the population size must be at least four individuals because each mutation step depends on three distinct individuals selected at random. These individuals influence the movement of another individual and guide the search toward better solutions. After mutation and recombination, a selection process is applied to compare the newly generated solution with the original one. The better performing solution is kept for the next generation. Through repeated iterations, this process enables the population to gradually converge toward an optimal or near optimal solution. Ant Colony Optimization, ACO, is a powerful computational approach inspired by the natural behavior of ants as they search for food. As ants move through their environment, they deposit pheromones that act as a communication mechanism within the colony. These pheromone trails guide other ants toward food sources and help the colony collectively discover the shortest and most efficient paths. Trails that are used more frequently become reinforced with stronger pheromone signals, creating a positive feedback loop back and that attracts even more ants. Through this balance of exploration and exploitation, ant colonies are able to adapt quickly to changing environments and efficiently locate resources. When applied to the traveling salesperson problem, ACO provides an effective framework for modeling how ants explore a set of cities. Each ant begins from an initial city and travels through the remaining cities while depositing pheromones along its path. As ants complete their tours, the pheromone levels on the traveled routes are updated, strengthening shorter and more efficient paths while reducing the influence of longer ones. Over multiple iterations, this collective learning process enables the colony to converge toward optimal or near optimal solutions. With a population of 50 ants working together, the algorithm demonstrates how cooperation and adaptation can lead to effective problem solving while minimizing overall travel distance. The study of evolvable hardware introduces exciting opportunities for applying evolutionary principles to physical systems. By incorporating concepts from evolutionary algorithms into hardware design, engineers can take advantage of the adaptability inherent in physical structures. Techniques such as using random number generation to modify device configurations, including systems based on hinge plates, illustrate a practical approach to optimization. This iterative process of variation and selection closely resembles biological evolution, allowing efficient designs to emerge through gradual improvements. Experimental methods, such as wind tunnel testing, further enable researchers to refine hardware configurations to achieve desired outcomes including reduced aerodynamic drag. This approach highlights the importance of adaptability and interaction among system components. In a manner similar to how ant colonies collectively discover optimal paths, evolvable hardware systems improve 
through random changes and selective reinforcement. This fusion of biological inspiration and engineering practice demonstrates how interdisciplinary approaches can drive significant technological innovation. As the field of data analytics continues to evolve, organizations are increasingly recognizing the transformative impact of integrating advanced technologies into their strategic frameworks. Predictive analytics plays a vital role in enhancing the accuracy of market forecasts while enabling businesses to identify emerging trends and shifts in consumer preferences more effectively. By applying sophisticated algorithms, companies can analyze large volumes of data to extract actionable insights that guide marketing decisions. This proactive approach allows organizations to anticipate changes in consumer behavior and respond quickly, helping them maintain a competitive advantage in an increasingly dynamic marketplace. Despite these advantages, the use of extensive data sets must be carefully balanced with ethical considerations related to privacy and data security. As organizations collect and analyze consumer information, they must navigate complex regulations that govern responsible data usage. Ensuring regulatory compliance while maximizing the value of data analytics is essential for maintaining consumer trust. Additionally, excessive reliance on predictive models can result in simplified assumptions about diverse market segments. A deeper and more nuanced understanding of consumer behavior is necessary to protect niche markets and encourage innovation in marketing strategies, ultimately strengthening relationships between businesses and their audiences. Although advanced technologies provide valuable support for decision-making, they can also create a false sense of certainty. This perception may cause organizations to underestimate the complexity of human behavior, which is often unpredictable and difficult to quantify. An overemphasis on personalization can overwhelm consumers or make them feel pressured by targeted marketing efforts. In such cases, privacy concerns and consumer fatigue may arise, potentially weakening brand trust and long-term loyalty. Conversely, a thoughtful and transparent approach to data usage can generate meaningful insights into consumer needs and expectations. When organizations prioritize genuine understanding rather than relying solely on data metrics, they are better positioned to build authentic and lasting connections with their audiences. Businesses must carefully balance personalization with ethical data practices to remain inclusive and credible in their messaging. By embracing diverse perspectives and experiences, organizations can enhance their marketing strategies while avoiding the creation of narrow echo chambers. This openness fosters stronger engagement, supports innovation, and contributes to sustainable growth. <laughs>